Have you ever seen a bird so big it could block out the sun? Imagine a bird with wings so wide they stretch longer than the tallest basketball player. That's the California condor. They are the biggest land birds in all of North America, with their bald heads that can change color from pink to red depending on their mood, and a fluffy black feather collar. They look like ancient kings of the sky. For thousands of years, these magnificent birds glided over canyons and mountains. They are nature's cleanup crew, which is a super important job. They eat things that other animals have left behind, which helps keep the environment clean and healthy. They don't hunt for their food. They're more like treasure hunters, searching for their next meal from high above. But a long, long time ago, our condor friends got into big trouble. Their world started changing. The places they lived got smaller, and some of the food they found wasn't safe for them to eat. Slowly, their numbers got smaller and smaller. It was a very sad time. It got so bad that by the 1980s, there were only 22 California condors left in the entire world. Can you believe that? Just 22. It seemed like our giant winged friends might disappear forever, becoming just a story in a book. But then, something amazing happened. A group of very kind and smart people, scientists and animal lovers knew they had to do something. They decided to bring all the remaining condors into a safe place, like a special bird hotel, to protect them. It was a huge risk. No one knew if it would work. In their safe new homes, the scientists helped the condors have babies. They used puppets that looked just like adult condors to feed the chicks. Why puppets? So the baby birds wouldn't get used to people and would know they were condors, not humans. They wanted them to be wild and free, just as they were meant to be. The plan worked. The condor family started to grow. First there were a few more, then a dozen more, and then hundreds. When they were strong enough, the scientists began to release them back into the wild, back to their homes in the canyons of California, Arizona, and Utah. Today, there are over 500 California condors, with most of them flying free in the wild. It's one of the greatest comeback stories in the animal kingdom. From only 22 birds, 200 soaring in the sky, it shows what we can achieve when we work together to care for our planet and its amazing creatures.